Rooted Cuttings Standard Method It's important to make rooted cuttings from the very good mother wines to ensure that your pepper farms are virus free and give the best yield. Identify and label selected mother plants during October-November for the collection of runner shoots. The mother plants should be in the age groups of 5 to 12 years. Consistently high yielding variety and free from diseases, especially viral diseases. Please watch our training video on selection of mother plants for more details. Select runner shoots that are produced at the base of the mother plant and keep them coiled and raised on a stake to prevent soil contamination and from striking roots in the soil. Separate them from the vines during February-March. The middle one-third portion of runner shoot is preferred for planting. Very tender and too mature or woody shoots are to be avoided. Disinfect the cutting tools. Leaves are to be clipped off leaving a small portion of the petiole on the stem. The selected runner shoots are cut into one to two noded cuttings. Cuttings are to be treated with Pseudomonas fluorescence culture. In a wide mouth container of 1 litre capacity, mix 250 grams of the culture and 750 ml water. Dip the cut ends of the cuttings in the slurry for 20 minutes. Prepare nursery mixture and fill in poly bags of size 20 into 10 cm or 15 into 10 cm with enough holes to ensure proper drainage. Wet the soil in the filled bags. Treated cuttings are planted in polythene bags at the rate of 2 to 3 cuttings per bag. The cuttings should be planted with at least one node in the soil during February. Soil is pressed around the planted cutting. The planted cuttings are watered frequently. After planting, the nursery bags should be kept under good shade. In large nurseries, sheds with 50% shade net are to be erected. During the rainy season, the top of the sheds may be covered with 200 gauge UV stabilized polythene sheets to prevent dripping of water onto the poly bag. Judicious watering is recommended in the nursery to ensure high humidity and moderate temperature conducive for optimum sprouting of the cuttings. Heavy watering leading to stagnation should be avoided. Keeping the cuttings for about 20 days in a moist chamber covered on all sides with transparent polythene would ensure higher percentage of sprouting and better establishment. The cuttings with 3 to 4 leaves of 3 to 4 months of growth would be ready for planting in May-June. So, two noted pepper cuttings are uh, actually planted in a bag of 7.5, 7 into 5 centimeter size and the cuttings are planted in such a way that each uh, bag should accommodate four cuttings so that uh, the percentage of recovery will be almost 100 percent and uh, by uh, within three months because this uh, nursery we have planted during the march first week and is hardly three months old quality or the peculiarity of the planting of runner uh, rooted cuttings is that uniformly thick uh, cuttings are to be planted in one bag or else the uh, thinner ones will germinate first and the thicker one take more time to germinate. Uh, growth will be uniform and the establishment will be 100 percent. Then one more thing is that uh, within three months uh, you can see the roots. The healthy roots are coming out of the bags. So generally the farmers are following uh, planting two rooted cuttings per standard so we can easily uh, dismantle these bags and we can use two plants per standard and uh, like this uh, a perfect uh, management aspects while cre while uh, uh, developing a nursery or uh, uh, conducting the activities in the nursery itself please download the ipc farmers app for your country from the google play store or from the App Store for more training videos, guidance on cultivation, daily price information, marketing support, exchanging ideas with other farmers, and for online help from an expert. Search for IPC Farmers app.